Hello, our travels have taken us to the desert. We're at the King Fahd Stadium in Riyadh. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And everyone here on tenterhooks, you'd have to say, with good reason, it's France versus Argentina. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Here's the side France will go with. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Rafael Varane plays with Dayo Upamecano in central defence. Kylian Mbappe starts with Kingsley Coman out wide. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. The Argentina first team. Emilio Martinez is the goalkeeper. Lionel Messi starts with Angel Di Maria on the flanks. And leading the line, Lautaro Martinez. And now they get the ball rolling. Upamecano now potential danger there it is a delightful start to this match just what they were hoping for Well, let's take another look. It's a really well-timed pass to break the offside line. And then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. One nil then. Lisandro Martinez. Montiel. Here's Marcos Acuna. Coman, sloppy. Now options are plenty. And a chance to level it. Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long. And this match is level again. Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. So in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser, 1-1. Kylian Mbappe moving the ball forward with purpose he quartered the attack illegally now perhaps a card is forthcoming well there it is the first caution of this match well he didn't need to make the challenge did he he's under pressure now it's a long time to go in this game and that is a free kick artist at work what a goal it was
Well, here it is again, and what a free kick this is. From that distance, he has to strike it so well. But you do have to question the goalkeeper. I think he has to do better there. It's still a wonderful strike, though. Well, back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1. France moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? No way through. Gonzalo Montiel. And now passing it through. Opportunity. Oh, there it is. A back and forth sort of match. Now they're level again. The lead lasted nearly minutes. Well, as you can see from the replay, it's the perfect through ball from Messi. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. So underway again at 2 all. Lisandro Martinez. Di Maria now. Alexis McAllister. Far from a good pass. Messi. Well, oh, that's a super ball over the top. And still looking for space. He got nothing but ball. He's conceded the corner. And the short option preferred. Taking care of business defensively here. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Well, couldn't quite find his teammate. Fine run from Mbappe. That's excellent defending following the cross. De Paul, Montiel, Rodrigo De Paul. And room now out on the flank. Safe pair of hands, did his job. Teo Hernandez, and given away. And that's very good refereeing to let the play flow. Coman. Not to be advised giving the ball away in that position. Kunde. Well, racing past his man. Coman. That's well blocked. Rodrigo de Paul. The ball with Martinez. Marcos Acuna. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Can he finish this? And a goal! Well, as you can see from the replay, it's the perfect through ball from Lautaro. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. So back underway. Will there be a response from France here?
Camavinga. Good move in the making from France. Great block. And out of play for a throw in to France. And unfortunately for him, he had worked his way into an offside position. And I think everybody in the ground could see that was always going to be offside. Well, Argentina haven't had that much of the ball so far, but that won't bother them because when they win it in deep areas, they've got forward with pace and with numbers. It's been a great counter-attacking display. It's really good without the ball, and the all-around performance levels have been high. It should be! And it's a double for him! No way for the opposition to contain him, and no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, you have to ask, where's the defending? The keeper is completely exposed, but he still had to finish it, and he did it really well. It's a good goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Kunde. Aurelien Chouameni. Well, is it going to end up being productive for them? Well, keeping it on the ground, slightly off target, however. Messi, Di Maria, Martinez, can he find the net? It could have been awkward for the goalkeeper. Fired over by Messi, and the keeper takes the fall, but the main thing is he held on to it. And unable to keep the ball. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Martinez. And they deal with the threat this time. Running with the ball confidently. Marcos Acuna, Enzo Fernandez, Montiel, the ball with Martinez. Will he finish? What a block! And there it is, the half time whistle. Well, I must say, we've really enjoyed watching Lautaro Martinez up to this point. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. And a fine tackle. McAllister and Messi's incisive pass and a goal to increase their advantage to three can they be stopped well let's see this again what a pass this is from Messi and what an emphatic strike it is from Di Maria hit with his laces it's a great goal hit with power So they restart the game, and only one team in it. Nkunku. Well, that ball looks promising. That's useful play. 
And in! Oh yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. Not a scoreline we see all that often, 5-3. Gonzalo Montiel, Fernandez. Another perfect position to read it. Coman. And Kunku. And back with Griezmann. Palms away by the keeper. Well, what a brilliant save that was. How did he keep that out? What can they do from here? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Not the best challenge, free kick. Well, any goalkeeper would be disappointed if he didn't save that. Chouameni. Here's Mbappe. Oh, good vision. Hernandez. Well, he stopped them in their tracks. And into the last 30 minutes now. France come away with it. Plenty of options. And let's give credit to the defending. Messi. Wonderful vision from Lionel Messi. Textbook defending inside the box. And coolly done, despite the mounting pressure. McAllister. Rodrigo de Paul. And a poor ball. Griezmann. Nkunku has it. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Chance to play it in, and the snuffing out of the cross there, and able to get a body in the way. Gonzalo Montiel. The ball with Martinez. Montiel. A quick low ball. Well, it didn't really work the keeper when all was said and done. Twenty minutes to go in this one. Just cutting off the supply. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Oh, it might be! Oh, good reflexes from the keeper, and the danger averted. And time for the change now. Taken short. Crossed into the penalty area. Dembele. Can he get one back? And fine goalkeeping.
So the corner played into the box. And the danger still on. Upamecano. A chance to eat into their lead. Oh, and it goes! Another goal! And I'll tell you what, the impossible is becoming quite possible. Well, here it is again. And when you clear the ball, you have to get height and distance on it to give your defence time to readjust. They don't do that. It's a poor clearance. And suddenly, the ball's in the back of the net. So back underway, can France find another goal? De Paul. Here's Marcos Acuna. Otamendi. Rodrigo De Paul. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. And the no nonsense clearance. Dybala. Oh, stylish ball. What can they do now? Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Mbappe. Kamavinga. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not on their side. Well, here it is again, and the clearance just isn't good enough. Giving up possession in a dangerous area, just poor defending all round. And level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. Fernandez, Dybala, here's Marcos Acuna, just the challenge that was required, how can they nudge in front late on here, Nkunku, now Griezmann, well just the tackle that was needed, Alexis McAllister. Jules Kunde on the ball. Well, the electronic board showing three additional minutes. And players waiting in the centre. The cross played over and work to do defensively. Tagliafico. Now with Messi. And he read it well, intercepting it. Kylian Mbappe. And there's the whistle, all even at the end of 90 minutes here. And so the penalty shootout about to commence. And as a play, job done from the spot. Not to be from the penalty spot. A Panenka penalty and a brilliant goal. And it's gone in. And he steps up to take the shot. And he scores! And he finds the net. He could hardly miss. His turn to try to convert from the spot. And the penalty converted down the middle. Almost intolerable pressure.
Goalkeeper beaten from the spot. And now he knows what's on the line. If he scores, they win. Oh, a superb save. Clinical, as always, in front of goal. Can he keep us cool? And the penalty converted here. So lethal in front of goal. And he steps up to take his penalty. He had to score, and he does. In it goes. And up he comes, doing his best to remain focused. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. Well, this could be the one. Goalkeeping. A goal here to finish it. In it goes. That seals it. Well, under pressure, that's a very composed penalty. And over the course of the game, they just about deserved it.